Hello everyone, this is Vakas Hamid and I'm bringing you another gaming review this weekend which is actually SlitheringDragons.io So, I know most of you guys have already heard about Slither.io and it's kind of a similar game So, let's just move on to the game itself and uh, here you can see that I have to choose my gender so I'm gonna choose the female dragon just, be just because I like the female dragons more than I do like the male dragons here So, choosing my dragon here uh, now you can tell the uh, game mechanics are pretty much the same here as of the slither.io and uh, you have to you know collect these collectibles which are dragon balls here in this particular game and you have to go as much as you can so that you can just get on top of the leaderboard here so the additional thing about this game is basically is that it is actually divided into two teams here the genders so if you're a female dragon, uh, then the female dragons here won't do any harm to you because you're just acting as a team ally. Uh, but uh, you have to slay the other dragons. If you are uh, playing as a male dragon, then you have to slay the female dragons here just to earn the more points. And uh, there are two kind of leaderboards here basically. One is uh, uh, in, in terms of length. So you, uh, you have to go as much as you can so that you can actually get on top of the leaderboard. And the other thing is there is this uh, kind of a middle earth thing which are basically the territories divided into different dragons male and female dragons and you have to capture them so this is kind of a global war between female and male gender uh, dragons and uh, the more dragons that you kill uh, the more uh, uh, kills you will have in your leaderboard in that point so i'm gonna have a sneak peek there in the leaderboard after my, uh, i finish the game here and uh, also uh, visually talking about this game it looks pretty good you know i mean look at the dragon ball effects uh, all of these things are pretty good to me, look pretty good to me considering that the game is still in the beta version because i talked to the people uh peanut butter labs who actually developed this game and they were saying that they are actually looking forward to this game and they are going to release a lot of new things into this game and one of them is fireball attacks and I just can't wait to see that I mean uh, fireball attacks will just give this game a whole new true meaning to this to this dragon game here I just can't wait to see that so let's just uh, try to kill ourselves and um, I think we have killed a lot uh, a lot of other dragons uh, maybe three or four dragons we should have a good uh, good number in the end of the game so let's just, let's just try to kill myself Yeah, so now you can see that uh, my length was basically 43 and uh, I have killed 6 dragons and uh, here is the leaderboard. So in the left panel uh, you would see that th these are the top 5 users and down below this is me because I'm actually logged in as Wujahat and also I am the second best scorer in this game and at the right of the side you see uh, I killed 6 male dragons. Now that this would go here in the in the male killed dragons were females by the way because uh, they have only captured the 26 percent of the territory and male dragons have only uh, captured around 74 percent of the territory this is all what this game is about um you know i think this game has re a really good potential and it is still in the beta version make sure you check their page out on the play store and if you think that there is anything missing in the game you can just give them a constructive feedback on their play store so this is it guys thanks for watching my review make sure you subscribe to my channel Bye-bye.